200 years or more, Crofton's been burning coal as its main fuel and will continue to do so. But to improve our sustainability over the last few years, we've been trying some alternatives. The first alternative we tried was what's now called e-coal, which is a mixture of crushed olive stones and coal dust. And we had some success with that, although it's not entirely certain that we could use this as our main fuel. Today, for the first time, we're trying this fuel, which is a fuel made as a byproduct of rapeseed oil production. And uh, we've literally just put the first shovelfuls of this fuel into our boiler and we'll see how it uh, performs. This is really exciting that it might actually work, but we've still got to be cautiously optimistic because we've been here before with E. coal and then it's failed. So we just hope, really hope, that this is going to be the one. Hello, my name's Phil Thompson. Uh, I work for a company that called Phoenix Speciality Oils Limited, which produces this fuel. It's made from the byproduct of extracting oil from rapeseed. We call the byproduct rape meal, and this is compressed into uh, a briquette form for use as the fuel. For each tonne of seed that is, uh, that is uh, put into the seed presses, we produce about 600 kilos of this meal and the rest is the oil. What we're hoping is that um, we can start to use this as a biofuel to replace coal. As you can see, we're using the uh, biofuel at the moment. We've got a good response from, uh, compared to the e-coal, it's, uh, it's a lot quicker to ignite and get going, so we just keep feeding it in and see what happens. It's burning above it. Yeah. Because we've got a layer of, of briquettes on the, laying on the on the on the grate and we're burning actually above that. Seems to be, yeah. yeah. It doesn't glow like coal though. It doesn't glow no. Not no. underneath anyway. No, because that's that's really that's probably being kept cool it looks with like the air going through. It. It, yeah. yeah. it goes to look like coal on the top. Obviously the air's getting too it's, it's, it's getting through, yeah. 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 Which is probably yeah. anything down as you've seen we've got our engines running now so so far the test's been very successful we've got pressure raised in the boiler and i'm hoping that we're going to have a good test over today and we've got a lot more to learn but it's been very uh, very pleasing 